Hello people of YouTube, this is Joe516 here, yeah, oh crud, this is not working that well. Anyway, I'm using Hypercam right now, um, to record this. Uh, by which I, when I said that, I mean like it's not getting the full screen, but I can work with this. This is just to show you how to play the, the HOTD2 game on the computer. Now, to do this, all you need is go see it. Now, you see when I do this, right now, let me move this so you can see it, and play the game. Now, I'm not sure if you can see it that well. Sorry about this, uh, it takes a little bit for it to load. You can get the Sega sign and all that, but then watch what happens after it. Right. You get nothing. Instead of getting the real screen you usually get, you get that. And the worst part about it, you can't um, exit out of it, so you have to open up this thing to close it. Which is horrible in my blood. Uh, I jacked this thing up too much, so now it's all like this. Sorry about that. Right here. So, how do you fix this, you may want to know. Well, it's actually quite easy. All you have to do, I mean, all you have to have is the right know-how. You go here, and I'm not sure if you have to do it to all of them. Uh, but you right-click go to properties compa compatibility and run it inside windows 98 windows me or whatever you, it is and run in these two ones just those th things and then you press apply and okay um i don't know why i do but i when i do this step to all of them you know just every single last part of it because I don't know why I just think that you're supposed to I'm not really sure about that but it works for me so don't judge it works someone could probably say something else I'm pretty sure I don't need to use it for all of one but you know right here and here and like that now if you remember, we didn't get any, um, didn't get any play on the last one. This time we will, but here's the little catch. When you run all run, it makes the screen smaller. So you play it, and after a little bit, you get right on to the screen. And remember what happened after this? Well, now it should work. See? So that's how you make it work on Windows 7. But I'm not sure about the other ones. And as you can see, it's pretty good. It's a little slow right now because I have the thing videotaping. Anyway, that's all. Thanks for watching. Hope you learned how to do this and hope it works for you. Goodbye, y'all, and have a nice day, or whatever.